Hey everyone, Spencer Kaufman here with the Honest Reviews YouTube channel. Today we are reviewing a portable air conditioner, or what I like to call a humidifier. This is a cool product, it came in a great packaging, so you can check out the unboxing video that'll be on this channel, the Honest Reviews YouTube channel, unboxing this. Uh, came packed very well, I will say it was kind of a funny thing. The remote uh, came just in the bottom of the box with the power cord here, and uh, there was a little bag that I imagine the remote was supposed to go in, but the lazy packing people didn't put it in the bag, so it was just all in there loose. Uh, that is kind of a negative mark on the product packaging when you pay for a, a nice product and then it comes uh, with the, the packaging in there. Just don't even put the bag in there and then I'd never know the difference, but it's kind of an interesting thing. Also, the other thing I want to mention, this is a USB plug. so. This one is like similar to a phone charger, and then it plugs into a USB, but they don't give you a wall adapter. Now, I understand that because uh, you can see these are all in like Chinese or something. So this product uh, was sourced from China, and I, I suppose if they're sending it to places in China or the US or Europe or wherever, the, the plugs are different. So they just give you a USB, and you can use your own wall adapter. Fine, I get it. But uh, at the same time, it, it would be kind of nice to include that, but then they'd probably want to charge more. But for a $70, $80 product, I feel like they could include a wall plug uh, for this. But the fact that they didn't, obviously didn't hinder anything. Hey, the product works well, which is important. Uh, I would say, like I said, it's more of a humidifier. If you want it to be a true air conditioner in that it cools down the air, then you need to put ice in the tank. I really like that there are two tanks, so my recommendation for optimal air conditioning would be to fill the top one with water and then some ice. Fortunately, they have the top large enough that you could get a lot of ice cubes in there. I mean, it wouldn't be a problem to fit ice cubes in here. So I'd fill this one like, like it is now, three quarter of the way, with water and then put some ice in there. Now it says you have to use uh, distilled, no, not distilled. You have to use purified tap, <laughs> Do not use distilled water or purified water. Use tap water or mineral water. So just use water from the faucet. That's what you got to put in here. Uh, uh, anything else, they say it'll, it'll mess up the inner workings. Really, there are no inner workings though. This, this opens up and there's a little uh, vent that goes down to this filter here. And then the bottom, I'm going to play with this here, so bear with me. If we lift this up, you can see the filter is coming out. It's almost like a honeycomb that slides up in there. So the, it, the, that, it's not really a filter, but it wouldn't get clogged. It's just like a corrugated cardboard material that the water from the bottom will resonate through and then it'll help humidify the air. So I would fill the bottom with probably 50% ice, 50% water, put that thing in, that's gonna soak up the water, it's gonna push out the air, which is gonna humidify your air, and because it's ice, um, because this one is ice and water, it'll mist out cold air, and then help you air condition it. Personally, I think you could put in any kind of water, humid, uh, distilled, purified, tap water, whatever, uh, but they say only use tap water, so tap water it is. Very, very easy to use. You want to know how to use it, go to How To Video Channel. Be a card up here with that video. You can watch how to use it, but I'll, I'll briefly go through it here as part of the review. Really, it's on, off, then you got three fan functions, uh, one, two, and three for more power. Timer function works well. I like that they have two, four, and eight hours. So if you don't like the fan noise, you can turn it on for eight hours while you're gone at work or something. It comes off when you get home. If you want it on overnight while you're sleeping, eight hours keep your room nice and cool and humidified. Uh, the high-low here, very neat. This is uh, dictating how much water is going to be misted out. So it's kind of like those fans that you see people with walking around in hot summer days that are spraying water at them. Kind of neat. And then the light has different features. So let's power it on and I'll show you. We got it on one, low mist, high mist. We'll start spraying some water out. It is cool air, which is nice. We can turn this fan on high, get it really starting to humidify the air. Turn it back to one, and you can see the light function, seven different colors. 
So that's pretty neat as well. So overall, I would say it is a neat product, good product. I would say it's worthwhile to purchase 70 bucks. Um, take it or leave it as whether you think it's worth it, but I like that it has the two tanks for humidifying and it also sprays water as well as uh, has water in that corrugated honeycomb to be uh, humidifying the air. So it's kind of like a dual humidifier and air conditioner as well as a fan. So really I would say it's more of a four in one. You got two types of humidifying, the vapor and just the residual. Then you got the air conditioning factor of the mist. And then you also have the factor of the fan. So it's like a four in one unit. Plus it could do a, a double up as a night light if you want to turn that light on. So it could be five in one uh, to help justify the expense. It also comes with a remote, which is handy if you're laying in bed, you want to turn it on or turn it off or add the different modes or set up a timer or change the light, whatever. Uh, works pretty well. Again, to see it in action, how to use it, you can uh, either get it from this video or go to How To Video Channel and also make sure to check out the unboxing video. I hope you like this video. Do so by clicking on that like button and show your support by hitting the bell icon and the subscribe button. And if you have any comments or questions, Please post them below and we'll do our best to get back to you soon. Thank you.